So I know you've done a lot of training with Cowboy Cerrone during your career. With him retiring, if you can put into words, you know, what you could take away from your training with him or what he's meant to your career. Well, uh, Cowboy meant a lot for my career. You know, uh, it was a typical guy training every day as much as hours as I could train and doing it like rigid, you know, just one way. And Cowboy told me the, the Cowboy way, you know, is, is having fun with your training because uh, you got to live a life worth living. But uh, this career is so short and so long at the same time, you know, it, take, it, takes, it could take away 10 to 15 years of your life. And if you're not enjoying the time where you're doing that, uh, it will be at the end of the day a waste of time. So you gotta learn how to mix work and uh, fun, and you can get even better results out of it. That's something that I learned from, learned from Cowboy. Have you spoken to him since his retirement? Uh, yes, uh, I actually saw him in, in Mexico. He was close to, he, he went to El Paso, Texas, no long ago for one of his races, uh, like uh, off-road racing. And uh, I invited him to go and have dinner with me to Mexico. So he was just hanging, we were hanging out for like a night or so. We were talking. I, I actually didn't talk too much about their retirement or anything like that. You know, like, you know, he's my friend. So for me, whatever he does, I'll support him no matter what. And, and that's it. That's all what matters for me.